So I just realized I haven't made a prediction video on this fight yet. Tyson Fury versus Dillian White. Who do y'all think is gonna win this fight? Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video, it helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. Tyson Fury and Dillian White, uh, as we all know, if you guys don't know yet, they'll be fighting on the 23rd of April, April 23, 2022, live over at the Wembley Stadium in the UK to be shown live for the UK fight fans on BT Sport box office pay-per-view. As we're here in the United States of America, it will be shown live on top rank ESPN pay-per-view. It's a very good fight. White is finally getting his shot at the world title. He is the mandatory challenger, so Fury has no choice but to fight him in front of 90,000 fans over at the Wembley. It's going to be a fun night of boxing. Cannot wait. Both fighters, both Fury and White, are coming off arguably the best wins of their careers with Tyson Fury beating uh, Deontay Wilder in their third fight, spectacular fight from October of last year. Definitely the fight of the year from 2021, in my opinion. And, um, you know, sealing pretty much uh, ending the rivalry with, with Deontay Wilder. And uh, now here he is fighting Dillian White, who is also coming off uh, the best win of his career in a rematch with Alexander Povetkin back in March of last year where he ended up stopping him after getting knocked out to Povetkin by Povetkin back in 2020. Dylan White seems to be in amazing shape. He's finally showing himself. Uh, they recently had a press conference and he seems to be in great shape, which he needs to be against Tyson Fury. And honestly, when it comes down to it, when it comes to winning this fight, I just think it depends on how prepared Tyson Fury is. If Fury comes to this fight um, in shape, uh, like he has done in the past few fights with Deontay Wilder, I think he should be okay. But if he's, you know, uh, out of shape, flabby, uh, fat, um, then I think Dylan White definitely has a good chance of pulling it off. But in the end, I think Fury with his boxing skills, um, I think if he plays it safe in this fight, I think he should be able to outbox Dylan White. If Fury decides to be uh, the aggressor and become, you know, become uh, the guy who's going to be moving forward, I think that would be a, the wrong game plan for Fury. I mean, it, it worked out with Deontay Wilder, but Dylan White's a big boy. Dylan White's a big boy. He 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 weighs around 250 pounds. His last couple fights were around 250. When he's in shape, unlike when he fought Maruz Wack, where he was 270 pounds, but when he's in shape, he's around 270. Tyson Fury, it, his last couple fights were around 270, 273, and. Uh, he, he purposely became heavy for that fight so that um, you know he could take Wilder's punches and he could use his weight on Wilder. And Wilder is a small guy, a smaller heavyweight who weighs around 230. Um, and I don't think that same game plan will work. I think Tyson Fury needs to be light on his feet, move around, and box. But that's just what I think. But in the end, it should be a great fight. I mean, Tyson Fury is back in the UK. I'm sure a lot of the UK fight fans are excited to see him back live in person. And, uh, you know, I'm sure Dylan White will go out there and do his best to try to pull it off. But like I said, all depends on Tyson Fury here. All depends on Tyson Fury. I'm still leaning towards Tyson Fury. It's kind of hard to go against him after, you know, be beating uh, Deontay Wilder. Uh, he has some momentum going for him. Uh, White, I mean, he's coming off a great win as well, but... Uh, I'm liking Fury's chances here with his ability to box. But I could be wrong. I've been wrong many times before. Anything is possible in the sport of boxing, especially in the heavyweight division. Will this fight end by knockout or TKO? In my opinion, I think chances are will most likely go the distance. In my opinion, I don't think Fury is going to try to look for the knockout. I think White is going to try to look for the knockout, but I don't think he can knock out Fury. I think he could knock down Fury, but not necessarily knock him out. But like I said, I could be wrong. I've been wrong many times before. Anything is possible in the sport of boxing, especially in this division, the heavyweight division, where one punch can change the entire fight. So looking forward to it. I say uh, goes the distance, eight rounds to four in favor of Tyson Fury. Let me know your thoughts. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. All right, thanks.